Howdy. So, I woke up this morning at 6.25 to go to the bathroom because I don't have a reason to get up that early. I pulled, oh, I went to the bathroom first. I didn't just pull down my pants. Pulled down my pants, I sat on the toilet, and then I heard music. But not just any music. Death metal. And I sat right back up. <laughs> Pulled my pants back up, <laughs> naturally. Um, peeked outside the door. Looked around. <laughs> I'm like, huh, oh, okay, I guess it's just someone's alarm clock. Um, my sister has an Alexa as an alarm clock, and I guess it plays music. So then, I like, listened a little bit, because I'm like, like, it's like, literally, like, like, the singer's, like, screaming and stuff, and I'm like, my sister isn't being murdered, right? But with, with a little more fear, because this, this is in hindsight. I was like, oh, God, no, 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 it's just music. So I peed. Yay. Then I went back to bed. But I didn't. Because I'm like, why isn't she turning that off? Why is she getting up at 6.30 when she, she doesn't have to get up that early? Um, I was like, I don't even think that's coming from her room. So I went out into the kitchen saw the Alexa on our, like, on a stool, and I said, Alexa, stop. <laughs> and then the music stopped. And then I went back to bed. And that is the reason that this video is probably titled Death Metal in the Kitchen. <laughs> there you go. A really long two-minute story. <laughs> I guess it's not long, but I could have to told it more shortly yeah so that's how my day started um i got my steps done for today this is only the first day of the month well it's, today's the third but it's the first day that i've gotten my steps for the month i could have done better i could i could have did the last two days um me <laughs> um so yeah so for our some insurance thing if you do um 10,000 steps for 12 days in a month, then you get $20. Wow. That's four miles a day. Um, and you only get $20. Which is... It's painful. But at least I get money for free. And I do a healthy thing. Um, yay. Uh, where was I going with that? Oh, yes. So I did my steps. Um, God, it was so humid today. As soon as I went outside, the clouds parted and the sun came out. And I'm just like... <laughs> Go away. Like, no, you're burning my skin. I burn very easily, if you couldn't tell by how white I am. Um, but it was cloudy and sunny. Humid. If it's going to be humid and cloudy, it might as well just rain and let the humidity go away. But it didn't. <laughs> it actually started raining as soon as I was, like, finishing up. Um... But boy howdy, was I hot and sweaty. It was so gross. Uh, so I took a shower. That's why my hair is wet. Um, actually, it's kind of dry. Mm -hmm. um, I also got a package. You might notice um, that I am wearing a dinosaur shirt. A dinosaur button-up shirt. Um, my, my stand is having a moment. Uh, yes, yeah, so I got this on Amazon. Um... Well, I got it. My mom got it for me. Um, my siblings did, like, a online shopping kind of thing. And, damn it, I wanted a dinosaur button-up shirt. <laughs> um, I got it from Amazon. It was, like, $25. It is, I think, 100% polyester. Oh, where's the tag? I don't know. <laughs> um, so it feels kind of, kind of crappy. Like, mm -hmm. um... The buttons, the buttonholes have like the, the fraying, so every time I put a button in and then take it out, half the time it like takes the threads out. Um, I just got this today, so I can't even say like every time. It's it's brand new. <laughs> um, it's a small. I'm usually a smaller medium in women's sizes, and this is a small in men's. Uh, ideally, <laughs> I would like to tailor it. Actually, I don't even know if I could because the, there's a pattern on it. I have no idea how tailoring works. Um, 
but whatever because I, I really just want to wear it just to like have it open anyway so I don't really need it buttoned um but I don't know maybe I'll wash it and it'll shrink a little bit does polyester do that it's a cotton thing isn't it darn it um but I don't know maybe it'll like feel less plasticky and I don't know <laughs> uh, this is kind of the, the style that I'm trying to go with. This is the uh, the flavor of non-binary <laughs> that I'm, I'm aiming for. Is the um the I don't I don't even know. It's the the funky button-up shirts, but like not buttoned up. You know, does that make sense? Um, happy Pride Month. <laughs> um, but yeah, I you know trying out new styles and you know being more comfortable with stuff. <laughs> Um, I've been perusing the men's section, not just online, in stores too, it's amazing. Um, kind of, not really, nothing fits because I'm small. They have nice jackets though, I actually have one hanging over there that I really like, but there's no, no reason to show it off. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, what else? Oh, yeah, yesterday I posted a video of an unboxing, and I'll just, I'll show you what I got, since that was like a... 30 second video. So I got two pops. I got Katara and I got Sokka um, with the new like wave coming out. Um, I gotta get these before they start going up. Um, so I got a deal. I got these for like, as a pair for I think $24. The big owie however was shipping. Shipping was $12 and I asked the seller if they could you know use FedEx instead of UPS or USPS. They could not. So I was like, yeah, you know what? I'm still getting a deal. Um, even that, which was like $37 or something. Don't... That's, I can't do math in my head. It was 24 plus 12. It's 36. Guys, I'm a STEM major. <laughs> but with taxes, it was like 37. Um, and I think together on the like Pop... Not Pop. Funko app, it was like 50-something. Um, so even with that, it was kind of a deal. Uh, the box is a little, hmm, there's a few dings. The, the back feels weird. I think it's just, like, shelfware. And I could just clean the, the window. I'm, I'm just picky like that. Of course, I gave the seller five stars because I care, but I don't, you know? You know? Um, <laughs> this poor person had, I think they originally were selling it for $40. But it was forty dollars and twelve dollars shipping, and I'm like, mm -mm, mm -mm. and it's been up for like a few months. Like this is like one of the first things that I like liked on Mercari, and then never bought. But then the person you know put out an offer for twenty four. I'm like, now that'll take. <laughs> um, I still need Ang, Appa, and Zuko to finish the the back there. Uh, I know there's like Azula and the cabbage guy maybe um in that set question mark um i don't really care i just want i just want the main squad i have um uh iro too uh they're over there sorry my dad wrote to me um e uh oh yeah so um i took pictures of them yesterday um if you follow me on my my collectibles account doodly fish collects i know it's very creative um i posted a picture of these two i also posted a picture of i have toph and iroh um fella doesn't stay on this freaking stand i don't know if it's like the right stand or whatever but fella will not stand god it was so annoying taking those pictures and he's just like Woo, like falling all over the place except i had him on a rock and i was like no please don't damage yourself <sighs> Yeah, so that's that. I got that. Um, the last video, second to last video, the one aptly, aptly, the one titled Transformers Yowie question mark question mark question mark. I don't know if it was on eBay question mark. Question mark. I don't know. Um, I thought that would be more popular. <laughs> um, if it, uh, okay, so the thing was, um, if it got a hundred likes, I would read one of the things and like review it. Um, but it got three views, so I'm probably just gonna delete it in a week because I really don't need that on my YouTube account. Um, but however, I did order um, the Transformers and My Little Pony official crossover comics, and I found out 
that there are two series because I was like oh wow I got the whole all four of them you know, there's apparently one from 2020 and they have different names they're, they're funny I thought, what was the last one though I think the last the one from last year was called friendship in disguise beautiful I love it and I think the new one is called magic of Cybertron question mark um I think the other series just had the four and then two new ones came out, and then there's two more that are supposed to come out in, like, June and July, question mark. Um, so, I will be getting those two once they come out. Um, I spent so much money, guys. <laughs> so, yeah, I have, like, I think 12, 12 things coming, because it's more than just that. 12 comic books, most of which I probably won't even read. I just really like the covers. <laughs> Damn it. Um, they should be, I think the last estimated date was June 12th. So hopefully by then I will get everything. I can do a video of that and then eventually read the My Little Pony ones. So I, just, I love that that's even a thing, guys. The covers are so cute. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Anywho, um, sorry, I'm kind of freaking out because um, mm -mm, I have to respond to my dad's message. Um, and he didn't seem very happy. Fun times. Um, yeah. Dinosaur shirt. Woke up. Well, not really woke up. I woke up to peeing. Well, not to peeing. To having to pee. I don't want my bed. Um, then, you know, hearing my sister's death metal alarm, I guess. Uh, apparently, my, apparently my other sister changed the alarm, but my other sister left the thing in the kitchen when she was cleaning it so it didn't really it didn't really work out for for her um the prank did not work um in fact i don't even think she heard it because it's right next to her door so that was a thing dinosaur shirt pops toads and blocking god they're so cute guys Toads are the most amusing thing ever. Alright, I'm sorry. I'll go. Um, I'll also post a, like, 15 second video of me, like, un unbagging this. Let me know what you think. Are you gonna get one too? Do you have any cool shirts? And where did you get them? Tell me where you got them. I need to know. Also, how expensive were they? Because shirts are expensive. What the heck? Man. Alright. Ta-ta. <laughs>